Hi you guys, welcome back to Vlogmas, good morning. Oaks and I are sitting here cuddling. Oh, thank you, so cute. He's actually scared of the camera. Wait, Oakley, you're doing kind of good. Uh, you're doing kind of good. You're so cute. Anyway, it's 10.38. I have just gotten ready for the day. I kind of already have started my day. I had a class this morning at 8 a.m. I'm just not a morning person. Okay, I take that back, actually. I am a morning person. Sometimes, some mornings, I'm just not into it and that was this morning so I didn't pick up the vlog camera. I am about to go work. I'm nannying today and then after that I kind of have fun things going on tonight. I'm going out to dinner with a friend. Okay actually that's the only thing I have going on tonight is I'm going out to dinner with a friend but I'm really really excited to see her. I haven't seen her in so long. She's my freshman year roommate and I haven't seen her in so long so we're gonna go out to dinner tonight and I'm so excited. Someone just rang the doorbell. Okay, let's go see who rang the doorbell. What are you barking at? I think we got a package and I'm hoping it's for me. For my mom. But I'm pretty sure it's our Christmas pajamas. It's from Victoria's Secret. That makes me so excited for Christmas. I'm sad it wasn't for me. I mean, it is for me, but like I can't open it now. Please, should we show everybody your reindeer? Get your reindeer. Go get your reindeer. Go get him over there. Your reindeer. Just kidding. Don't get your reindeer. Okay. I'm gonna nanny. Go nanny. I'll take you. I'll take you guys with me nannying, but I don't know if I'm gonna end up vlogging. So, this is what I'm wearing today. I'll show you guys. I kind of really like this pink thing. I got it from Airy. This is a size small. It's so cute. These are like my favorite shirts to wear because I do have bigger boobs. So like when I wear flowy stuff, it just makes me look way bigger than I am. And these kind of like cinch, like get smaller at the bottom. So I like them. Anyway, I love this color. This is what I'm wearing today. These in my Lululemon leggings. Yeah. I also had a coffee today and it's given me so much energy. Which is why I feel like this vlog's already all over the place. What? <gasps> Thank you. Ready? Whoa, so speedy. Do you want this? Ready? Yeah. Get it. Oh. He's the cutest. I'm sitting here while he's playing, and I kind of wanted to show you guys. I don't. I don't think I've talked about this on here yet, but I have an Instagram page, and it's called Life with. What? Come here. Say hi. Say hi. Say happy Vlogmas. Happy Vlogmas. You're, why are you guys so shy? Is that you? Yeah. Yes, it is. <laughs> yes, it is. You're down. What is that? Anyway, it's called Life with Joe Nicole. It's basically a lifestyle inspo, like personal blog account kind of, but it's all about like health and wellness and like healing chronic illnesses and all of that stuff because I do deal with chronic illnesses and I'm actually in the process of healing my own chronic illness right now. So I've been doing this for like three years, not this different page, but I've been dealing with a chronic illness for like three years now and I've gotten into holistic medicine like a lot throughout you want to back up here like a lot throughout it all um i've learned a lot about holistic medicine so basically i just post i made this account and i started posting on it to help other people because dealing with chronic illnesses are so so hard especially when you don't know what's going on and i just wanted like people to know that they're not alone and i've like just learned so many tips over the process of this that i wanted to be able to share with other people Anyway, that's why I started this Instagram page. And on it, I'm going to be doing 25 days of wellness. And I just posted, it's so cute. But if you don't follow me, go follow me. I'll link it down below. But I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna kind of plan out what I wanna post every single day just so I'm like going into it prepared. 
and yeah, I just kind of wanted to like show a little behind the scenes. So yeah, basically, if you don't follow me on that Instagram account, go follow me now, support, and stick around so that you can also do Vlogmas on this account and then the 25 days of wellness on that account. And basically, I just want like, it's going to be tips on like non-toxic living, um, tips to help with bloating. You want your shoes off? Okay, um, but tips to help with bloating, little lifestyle changes you can make to just be like the best version of yourself going into the new year. So that's kind of like my mind thought behind it all. But yeah, I'm so excited to be doing it. I'm so excited to post. And if you don't follow me, go follow me. This is, um, I'll put my little username right here and then I'll also have it linked down below. So go check it out. Hang out with this little squirt. Say bye. Bye. Here, they can't see you. Okay, now say, say bye. Bye. Say love you. Mm. You are the cutest thing ever. Good morning, you guys. I am going to make this a two-day vlogmas just because I didn't really film anything else yesterday. I didn't even film me going out to dinner, which is what I was the most excited for. But I honestly was just in like a really weird mood last night and I didn't feel like doing anything so yeah we're just gonna make this a little two-day vlogmas I hope that's okay I have a lot of fun things going on actually I am about to head out the door and I'm gonna go get my nails done they desperately need it because this one fell off last night so I'm gonna go get my nails done and then I also have a kind of exciting doctor's appointment I mean most people wouldn't think it's exciting but I'm excited just because I feel like I'm finally gonna get answers for things that I've been needing answers for so that is what my day kind of looks like today and other than that I like really honestly I think what I'm most excited for is I don't have that much schooling going on today like I have some assignments but I have no in-person classes today and I kind of just get to do like what I want to do with my day which I love doing that I like slept in this morning I had my little nice morning routine which I love I'm so excited to show you guys my morning routine because I have been doing like a low cortisol morning routine and I love it I love everything I do so I think in one of the vlogmases I'm going to um, show my morning routine I'm gonna head out the door now and go get my nails done. So let's go. I just got here to the nail salon. I'm here a little bit early. So I'm just hanging out in my car waiting until I should go in. I can't decide what color I want to do with my nails. I also kind of want, I always get the almond shape, right? Ignore that nail, it's ugly. But I always get like the almond shape and I kind of want to do like square, like the thin skinny square. I think I'm gonna get like a dark cherry red. I've gotten red already, but it's been like a raspberry red. And I feel like we're in the season of dark cherry red right now. So I'm gonna get that, I think. I usually just get dip nails and then I'll get shellac on top of like the dip base. Just because my nails are kind of more brittle. So if I just get shellac, my nails will break, like it won't last. But if I get dip base and then put shellac over top of it, they last and I also just like the look of like the shellac color better than dip color I just don't really like what dip color looks like I feel like it looks like grainy if you haven't done it you should actually really try I feel like my nails always look so good and I always love them um, and they stay for like a long time here's the little before my nails this one's so bad but yeah I'm back from the nail salon. This is the color. I'm obsessed with the color. I think it is so, so pretty. The camera makes me look really, really pale, but I swear I'm not that pale in person. Like, I don't know what is going on, but they look so good. I love them. So actually, I was like telling you guys before how I usually do dip and then I'll have them do like the shellac color over my dip. Well, she actually just did or dip color and I was too scared to say anything about it so I just let her do it and they don't look that bad my only thing of when they do that is sometimes I feel like they're too thick but I feel like they turned out really really cute I love this color it's called cherry berry at Ann salon if you're in the Kearney area but I love them they look so good I feel so much better they're my real nails but I didn't cut them down I just left them how long they were after they grew out and I kind of like it like I've been doing short nails recently 
and now I did long and I kind of like it. I'm done with that. I'm gonna go. It's only one and my appointment's not till two. So I'm gonna go to a coffee shop and go get a coffee because they have my favorite coffee in town and they don't have a drive-thru so I think I'm just gonna go in and get a coffee and that's like literally all I have planned for today I have the whole afternoon to do whatever I want and I love that for me I am obsessed with this color I'm obsessed with my nails hi there hi how are you good what can I get going for you the canela con and chair yes can I do that with almond milk please hot or iced ice yeah thank you I'll have you Thank, Thank you. I'll call it out when it's ready. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Hi, you guys. It's a little bit later now. I'm home. It's like 427. I got done with my appointment and came home and now I'm sitting here studying for my chem exam that I have tomorrow morning. I have a feeling this is where I'm going to be the rest of the night. There's just a lot to study. So I'm probably going to be here the majority of the rest of the night, which is not very fun to vlog, but I just want to come check in and update you guys that I'm home from my little errand day and that this is what I'm doing. Oaks is here with me. Right out. Yeah. I'm still obsessed with my nail color. I'm so obsessed. I also love that it's like, this is what it looks like with my phone case. But yeah, I'm gonna study some more. Okay, I'm taking a break from studying and I am going to do my little self care night like I talked about and self tan, taking everything shower, do all the things. So I wanted to show you guys kind of what I do prep for self tanning and then also what self tanner I use. But I don't really use an exfoliator on the scrubs, exfoliating scrubs. I don't use those just because a lot of them contain a lot of harmful products and I kind of got rid of that all. So instead I just dry brush, which I do this almost every single night anyways, just to get lymphatic drainage and also regulate my nervous system. So honestly, it's like... I was going to do it anyway, but I do this extra hard the night before I self tan just to get all my old self tan off and like all the dead skin cells and everything like that. So I'm going to do this before my shower. I do it before I shower because then not only will I like rinse all of like the dead skin off of me, but also it opens up my pores and then if I take a hot shower, it like releases a bunch of toxins. So that's why i do this before i shower and then this is a self tanner i use it is beauty by earth it's all clean there's no harmful ingredients so it's like safe to put on my skin i feel good about putting it on my skin i will say it definitely takes a couple layers to get to the color that i want it to get but i'll take that if it's like not does it have red 40 in it and not harmful for me? I don't care that I have to put a couple layers on. So usually I shower and then I just put lotion on like my elbows and my knees and my feet. And then I will put this on. I even put it on my face. I literally put it all over and then I let it dry. It takes about like 30 minutes to dry and then I'll put on another coat and then I'll sleep in it and then wash it off the next morning. So that's kind of my little self tanning routine. But I am gonna end the vlog off here just because I'm going to shower, self tan, and then probably be studying the rest of the night. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure you subscribe if you aren't already and stick around. I'm loving Vlogmas, I'm loving doing this. I'm sorry again that this was a two day vlog. I don't know if I'm gonna do more of those in Vlogmas or not. But yeah, definitely subscribe so you can see all of my videos coming up. But thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys later.